Hi, welcome back to Krishi's Excel Anywhere. Thank you for watching this channel. Today we are going to learn something very interesting and new, the formula. This is a question received from one of the subscribers that to remove the hyphens from this cell value and the next one, only the first 10 digits we need to extract. Also there was a one more question, can I become an expert in Excel in one day or at least watching by one video? According to me, it is really very difficult but I can give you guarantee you can become an expert in Excel by learning at least one formula or one tips every day and you can learn the formulas step by step with a good examples. So please subscribe to our channel if you haven't already done so that you will not miss any videos that we upload year after. So don't skip the video. Now we'll see how to remove this iPhone and what is the formula we can use here. You might have this kind of scenarios when you work on your data. So this will be really helpful. There are many ways to get this result. Now we'll see the easiest and simplest method. You can use substitute for this one, this scenario and the next one you can use substitute left mid. Title have we done this you can make it visible. Control one and you will get custom option. If you use your three colon, the particular cell value will not be visible. Right now it is hidden. You can remove that just by removing this three. Just I removed now and OK. Oh yeah, now you can see. That. So for the first one, we are going to use substitute and the next one we are going to use substitute and left. Always the best option to start the formula you should give equal and type substitute. If you are very new to Excel, read the syntax and arguments what exactly we need to give step by step. Now first we have to give a text. Whole text, I am going to select that D6 cell and comma. The argument, it says whole text. What is my whole text? Replace a certain character or word. Now we need to remove this iPhone. So that whole text we need to define here. How to define? Always that value should be assigned inside double quote. So whatever we assign inside the double quote, it is considered as text. Comma. I need to replace this with a blank. So let me give blank. Giving double quote twice. Close the bracket. That's it. And close the bracket. And enter. Let's see the output. Now we have removed the iPhone. So this is how we can use substitute. Next. This is a requirement. We need to extract only the first 10 digits excluding this iPhone. We need to give the formula in one cell, not in two different cells. First, you can give left formula. I mean, just type left and give, see the syntax. It says text. Okay. Next comma. Number of characters. How many characters I need from left? From left, I need 11 characters, including iPhone. Now, I need to exclude iPhone. How to do that? Do I need to give separate formula? No, that is not a requirement. In the same cell itself, I should exclude iPhone. Now, here we are going to use substitute. In the last comma, and we need to, what is that argument? Text. So, what already we have assigned the text with the left function. We got the output, 11 digits. From this text, we are going to remove iPhone. Double quote, iPhone, again double quote, comma. Replace with new text. What is our new text? Just blank. So give double quote twice. This is how you can do. There is another option without using a substitute. How can I extract only that first 11 digits? First you can give left formula. First let's extract only the first two digits which means CB. We'll take only two. So select the cell text and number of characters two. We got the output CB. Again now we need to extract the data from six to 5, the last one before I find your, you can use mid formula. So here I'm going to give and which means we are going to combine, combine two different values in one cell. I'll type mid and here it says the argument syntax text. This is the cell value and start number from 6. It means 1, 2, 3, 4 after I find fourth value from fourth value. Number of characters, how many characters I need to extract from here from 6 to till 45, it is 8 characters. Then close parenthesis, enter. See, you got the output. So this is how we'll be learning all new formulas moving forward. If you have any question, how to simplify your work, how to simplify your 
activity you can directly reach out to me in the weekends i can help you to resolve the problems if you found this video helpful please like subscribe to our channel and hit the bell icon for more videos thank you for watching